folks, Mr. Raven here, and welcome back to Seven Days to Die uh, for 21.2. It's night. And uh, we're heading out. Hopefully, uh, another exciting tier one. Uh, clear the area mission. Uh, for our new best friend, Gentle Trader. Um, hopefully, we can make her happy. So she, uh, you know, tear up by the mission, you know, giving us a little more responsibility. Uh, you know, you know, really depend on us. So we um, earn some more money and magazines. So we can learn some more stuff. I hope. Anyways. Uh, we are over there in a second here, so I'm just gonna ugh, drive a little faster. You know, I'm hoping um, this game, when it goes full release, uh, I don't I don't think the graphics is bad or anything. Uh, it's pretty good. When you're thinking about it's a um, what do you call it? A box hall game, I think. You know, where everything can be destroyed and used for res harvest for resources and stuff like that. Um, definitely looks more realistic than Minecraft, but um, who's counting, right? Anyways, let's see here. Is there a uh, litter box? Oh, you got your own little lake. But it looks like you're trying to cache fish. Unless you put fish into that, it's probably got, not going to be there naturally. I'm just saying. Um, but I hope the um, they do uh, on, uh, on release. I hope they do a um, like like Subnautica did just before it it, it released. They kind of did like a um, graphical update, so it was looking really good or really crisp um when launched um i've been playing this alpha for like actually i don't know i think they're just celebrating like 10 years in, in steam and i think it it was a it was a game long before it came on steam but 10, 10 years without going full release that's a long time not being in being a complete game but you know i'm not complaining um you know it's, it takes a long time to develop a new game and it's an indie studio so they haven't really had any other games and i'm pretty sure when it started to play the game it was like crowdfunded and uh, maybe one or two guys coding it so it's just gonna take some time um and i think it's it, you know it's it has probably gotten some more uh, people now to do the coding and stuff so hopefully we're coming up on uh, Yeah, coming up on um, full release soon. Yeah, who knows? For me, it's fine. But I, I've seen the development of this game. You know, it's coming from nowhere to where it is today, and it's just. And it's just um, actually an amazing development. I remember when the first time I heard about Seven Days to Die, and I saw some some uh, videos, uh, playthroughs from YouTubers stuff. Uh, oh shit! Give me my, my arrow back. 
Um, you know the the uh, the terrain and stuff like was was squares. You know, it, it was like seeing Minecraft. And now you actually uh, got blocks with different textures and. You know, the hills look like hills and stuff like that. It's actually an amazing development. Okay. Got a little bit of West, West vegetables, vegetables. It's pretty good if we need to uh, cook some hobo stew or something. And an outgoing door. Yeah. And also remember way back when um it's kind of funny if you got a pistol uh, you can scrap it into to part or you can take it apart it, it can and it was built out of four parts and uh you know those four parts could be um could be uh could be different levels and combined it would be uh, the sum of that level so if you could find parts that was better you can just change the part and then the whole pistol got a little bit better or you could use clay to make like a mold of the part and maybe create it a little better uh, i wonder if i could um probably has to open the door <laughs> uh, and the way you made ammo was, you know, when you found the first bullet, you kind of took that bullet apart as well, and then made a mole out of the the cartridge and the uh, the, the bullet, and you kind of had different sizes and molds you need to put into the fortress and stuff like that. It was actually pretty. Uh, um details it's more it's simplified now i think that simplification came when when they kind of made the first iteration of the um of the first console game they needed to simplify it a little bit because you know wood was wood locks then you can make that into planks and you can make the planks into sticks and some stuff was made out of sticks, and something was made out of planks, and something was made out of flocks, um, and so on and so so on and so on. You know, it was just more detailed in that manner, which I thought was pretty cool. Oh, don't have any more golden rod. Damn it! I uh, don't have any clay, so it doesn't matter. Carry a little bit more. And, you know, this leather chair looks like an old brown leather chair. Didn't do that in, in the olden days. So it's, it's come a long way in 10 years, but. Oh, that was saying, yeah. <laughs> That was a decoy body. Oh. Ooh. Um. I need eight of those. Got some potatoes down at the bike, so we could go back empty it. Ooh. Chicken soup doesn't have a doesn't have a recipe. We can eat that. I think I have goldenrod at home. And I actually needed goldenrod tea to get rid of the last um dysentery or what it's called. 
I don't want to talk 11 lockpicks. Um, not a mod. Let's get rid of the cloth. We got so much cloth. Don't really need it. I don't need it. Yeah, I'm not eating another sandwich right now. Still trying to get my stomach to be... Well. Oh, pistol. Ah. It's toilet paper. Thirty-four. I was about to say, I wonder if that, of uh, if the dates were right, but it's it's probably is, you know, it's not that hard to find a calendar. Was that it? It actually was. Huh. Okay, fair enough. And get out of here. Let's get out of here. Come on, Tony. Let's get out of here. Oh, we got a... Uh... Did we loot this? Oops. Oh, quick reflexes. <laughs> hey, you... I was about to say, you can't... You can't... Shit. I hit his leg off with a bat. That's pretty hardcore, if you ask me. Let's save that. Uh, uh, we got one cool clue. Clue. Actually, let's just take that one glue and make it into duct tape, which we can't because. Let's take the potatoes, maybe. Okay, I'm not sure. Yeah, leave that. That's fine. Oh my god. Might have to go home soon and um, empty my inventory. Uh, let's lose the... Okay, we can eat it. Uh, but yeah, for, for me, you know, um, they could actually make it a little more uh, in-depth in the um, materials and construction and stuff like that. I wouldn't mind that. Oh, but again, I, I, again, I do understand why they simplified. Isn't that a box I can loot? Fair enough. Well, that's pretty easy. Pretty easy. Easy like Sunday morning. Oh, little box. Oh, oh shit. Wow. Did you see my reflexes again there? <laughs> pretty hardcore, epic man. <laughs> Um, yeah, I'm just gonna go back to the trader, wait out the night, and, um, you know, maybe drive some goods back to our main base. Empty out in the, uh, got a lot of seats and stuff, might as well empty that out. Yeah, let me do that uh, through the night and stuff, um, I'm, I'm gonna keep the uh, recording uh, going just so if something happens, you know, I can uh, show you how stupid I were. Makes sense, right? <laughs> okay. Uh, let's try and see what we get. Uh, I made a, a single trip. Could have pretty much everything. That was pretty cool. Hello, Jen. I'm back. I am so glad to see. 
Congratulations. Oh, congrats. Ooh. My payment to the Duke now. Ah, yeah. Crap. I hope that was the, like, two pocket mod thingy. Could have used that. Let's take this just because then we have it. Ooh, we got double. Ooh, a trap bundle. Ooh, we can also get a bicycle. 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 Oh, is it worth? Mm, actually, not bad. Two times water filter. Hmm. Could also put two more. Let, let's take the um, let's take the filters. Um, jobs. Still doing tier one. What the heck, woman? Uh, let's just clear some zombies good. next time. Okay. Be careful. Ranger and station. Try not to get yourself killed. Hmm. Day 40. So still nothing new. Nah. Sorry, but I've never heard of a stim pack. Stim pack? You haven't? Oh. Let's kill those zombies out here and then uh, end the video. Come on, come on, bring it on, bring it on. Oh, I missed. Oh, yeah. This bad is hardcore. Anyways, um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, please show your support by leaving a thumbs up. If you have any questions, advice, or just want to sell me something funny, please do so down in the comment section below. If you're new here, please consider subscribing. And the last thing I want to do is just wish you all a great day. Have fun gaming. Bye. Bye.